Hello and welcome to this movie commentary reaction for 2002 The Ring. If this is your first time seeing my face or you're coming back, thank you so much for being here. I'm really happy to have you. So today I am going to be watching The Ring and if I'm honest I'm going to stall uh, a little bit before we get into the video because I'm genuinely terrified. Like I had this on my list uh, on my spreadsheet that I've spoken about before as like coloured in red because I looked up on does the dog die that website for like all the trigger warnings and stuff and I just kind of hated the look of it so I put it in red and I was like I'm never gonna watch this I don't even know why I'm that terrified of it like because I genuinely know nothing about it other than the fact that like a girl with long black hair crawls out of someone's tv and that if you watch a haunted videotape or something that you will die in seven days. When I was 15, I think, 14 or 15, in my English class, our teacher made us watch one of the scenes from The Ring to kind of like study it as like a media portion of, of the class. And all I saw, all I remember seeing, it was nothing even bad, was just like, the main woman getting the phone call and being like seven days or whatever it is um and i don't think i slept for a week so thanks mr clifford for that okay i guess i've stalled long enough so uh, i'm gonna watch the ring let's do it i forgot this was a dreamworks movie i can't believe that that's crazy oh so she's gonna die in like the next five minutes oh my god katie <gasps> Sis, you need to be having more of a reaction. Are you kidding me? I did! I don't know why I'm so scared, nothing's happened yet. I just- Oh, I've got like the heebies and the jeebies. What? No, why would you hand it over? Is If this is another fake out and it's just like Becca in the fridge. I'm gonna be so annoyed. Oh no, what's happening? Is Becca dead? Why would you walk in it? I would not step in the water. Oh no. Oh, I fuck. I hate this. He looks about five. You don't give a five year old detention. I know they were very close. Yeah. Aiden and his cousin. Was that the girl? Please. Is it going to be a creepy child drawing? There's always creepy child drawings in movies. Wait, what? Aiden drew these last week. Uh, huh? I don't like it when kids call their parents their name Aiden. when they're kid kids. Like, teenagers doing it, it's funny. Like, I call my dad his Honey? name. He's like a little man. Oh, what a cute little man. He's such a little man. He's the littlest man. I feel like this movie is going to be more sad than scary. I don't know. I feel like this is more about like family and relationships and like mortality rather than just like oh spooky tv demon this little boy looks like he hasn't slept in a month look at the fucking black circles around his eyes he looks like a tim burton character that's what you do isn't it ask questions oh is she like a journalist or something because that hasn't been established to solve a case. oh oh fuck Huh, no. Oh god. Oh boy. I am not sleeping for a month. Oh, it's fucking broody boy. What take? What's his face? The one that kills you when you want. He's from um The OC, right? Was he also in Jennifer's body? Is it him? Adam? Something Dylan in uh Dylan is in trouble is obsessed with him. Ooh. Oh, I hate that. Oh, I don't like that. I mean, it's so funny. That's cool. I like that shot. It's very Twilight, but I like it. Twilight copied this, 100%. I think this is the scene I was talking about at the beginning of the video where I saw the, the scene in English class. Do I have to watch it? And if I watch it through watching this, am I gonna get haunted? 
I don't have a TV in my house. So I don't know how it's going to do anything. But she might come out with a... <laughs> I don't want to look. I don't want to look. I really don't want to look. Oh, I remember that bit. That's just some maggots. Some people swimming. Why does she keep looking directly at the screen? Oh, I, f I feel like I'm going to be sick. Oh, I'm so anxious. I'm so nauseous. I feel like I'm going to be sick. Did my eyes do that? Is my phone ringing? Does it only work on landlines? Is this an analog type situation? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna take a selfie. I'm thinking maybe you should make sure I'm not broken. No, I should know more about it first. Well, isn't that why I'm here? So you can okay, from I'm not blurry. Oh, I'm joking. No, don't watch it again. Who is this man, by the way? Do we know? If you watch it twice, do you get an extra seven days, or do you die twice as quickly? I'm sure it's a lot scarier at night. It's not supposed to be scare. Answer the phone, bro. You'll see. A go on. Answer it. Can you get that? No, it's for you. Who is this random handsome man? If you don't answer the phone, do you not die? Is it like a weeping angel situation where like the image of an angel is an angel, so if you watch a copy of the original, you still die? Wait, what? It's, it's a phone, babe. The, she left a voicemail? I didn't know demons could leave voicemails. Girl, you're gonna make everyone in your fucking place die. Don't watch it again! You fucking idiot! Like, yes, I am scared, but I'm also annoyed because she's just putting loads of people in danger for no fucking reason. Mm -hmm. Hey, Noah, can you pretend for one minute that I don't read Video Geek magazine? Okay, did she seriously the, just do the, the, makeup the English like signature for thing did the when people speak like scientifically? Camcorder. Who is he though? His character hasn't been established to me. Is he an ex-boyfriend? Is he a colleague? Is he a friend? I don't know who this man is. Did I miss it? Was I not paying attention? That fly is really interesting because it looks like stuck on. Is it alive? Oh my god. She was fucking added in. <laughs> she was added in post production. That's hilarious. Look at her, she stands out. Everyone else is wearing like white. She that's like me at family gatherings though. Like everyone's wearing normal clothes and then I'm just like the one emo family member. Ooh, he's got a wiggly face. What's wrong with the water? Oh no, oh no, Ugh. come on, it's over. I literally can't watch people. Oh my god, I'm gonna be sick. I'm actually gonna be sick. Oh my god, that was horrible. Wait. Is she... Is she still dreaming? No! He's already watched it, babe. Where is she, Rachel? Why do you keep calling her Rachel? She's your mom. Call her mom. Her son. Wait, is that her? E when was that established? So that's her ex-husband or ex-boyfriend? When did I did I miss it? Was I just not paying attention? What if she did what the woman from Final Destination did, where she like locked herself in a padded room where nothing could get her? I hate horses. I'm so. This is the scariest part of the movie for me. I'm terrified of horses. They are so unpredictable, and they do shit like that that terrifies me. And they have like really human-looking eyes. Yeah. Uh uh. <laughs> This is the worst. Hun, leave. It's stressed. 
Oh god. Horse on the loose. <laughs> I really don't like horses. I really don't like horses. They are so fucking scary. Like, they just do crazy shit like this. <gasps> oh god! I hate horses, but I don't want to see animal cruelty. You win. Aren't you a journalist? Just show them your credentials. And ask- What? Did he seriously think that was gonna work? He was just gonna walk in and be like, Hey, can I like see those records? And they were gonna be like, Oh yeah, of course you can, handsome man that we don't know. I'll give you anything. Like you can't just walk in and be like, <laughs> Stop. Um, yeah, I know the records are upstairs. Like, can I- Can I see them? Like, she's been dead for 24 years. It doesn't matter. Ugh. Also, was this filmed in Forks? Because I swear that's Bella Swan's house. You don't want to see this, too? Why would it- I'm not even curious. Ha you know- She knows that it kills people. Why is she walking around being like, Hey, I have this tape that I know kills people. Do you want to see? Like, she showed this Noah guy who's apparently her ex-husband. She's asking this man, whose fucking wife it is, if he wants to watch it. But yet she gets annoyed when her son watches it. So she's happy for other adults. And she just goes around broadcasting that she has a murder tape. But when it's her son, she's like, no, not, no, unforgivable. Can't, can't watch it. She, oh my god. Ah! It's Samara. She looks fucking possessed. And the she award for worst parent ever goes to this guy. Wait, so is Samara dead? Yeah, go to the barn. Maybe if you like sage... Sorry, were those supposed to be horses? If you like cleanse the barn, sage the barn. She doesn't... Not once has she crawled out of the TV. I'm kind of disappointed. I was waiting for that. I do like Samara as a villain though, but I feel like she's not. She's not a threat. I like the idea of her character. I like the idea of her as like. To me, she's not a villain. She's an antagonist. But we haven't seen enough of her to be scared of the, like, day countdown. It's gonna fill up with water, right? And she's gonna crawl out. If she does, that'll be so cool. What the fuck? The bees! Bye! Oh, no. Oh. Oh, I don't like that. There's claw marks. She tried to climb out. Is that a fingernail? Yeah, oh, ew. Show her. Show her, sis. Give me the backstory I need. I don't think she want- she didn't want to hurt people. Just give her a hug. There is no way. She's been down there for like fucking 30 years. Yes, she is. She's just not speaking for some fucking reason. I'm here. Yeah, it took you a goddamn minute. Is he dead? Or is he just asleep? Please tell me he's just asleep. Why was he laying like that? That's so fucking psychopathic. Why did you do that? Because she was suffering. You're not supposed to help her. Oh no, what? Okay. Don't you understand, Rachel? No. Oh my god, I'm so nervous. Is she gonna finally crawl out of the TV? Is it finally gonna happen? Oh! Yes, girl! Come on, give me that scare. Oh, oh, it's awful, I love it. Get away from the TV. She's clearly getting close. Ah! Oh, I love it. I love it, I love her. Wait, but how did he get in the chair? Because he was all the way on the floor. Did she like ghost, Ooh. ghost lift him up into the chair? Are you not gonna tell her? You just gonna let the goth girl from NCIS die? 
Or find him. <laughs> Give it, yeah, there we go. That was the ring. I don't know why I went into this so afraid. Like, I think the start of the movie, when all the spooky stuff was happening, that was scary. I think the ending was really exciting when they went into the well. Um, and I think the ending, like the last 20, 30 minutes were really good and the first 30 minutes were really good. So that kind of um, in between like 40, 45 minutes um, where it was just kind of them traveling to places. I feel like, okay, I know that during the film I was asking for backstory and for explanations to stuff, but they kind of did it anyway in the flashbacks. So we could have just had a few flashbacks of like the parents or the psychiatric unit or finding things. Like I feel like a lot of the places that they went to and the people that they spoke to um, we didn't really need. I don't really have much else to say. I thought some bits were good, I thought some bits were not so good, but that's kind of how it is with every movie. Um, I think maybe if I watched it in the dark I would have been more afraid, but unfortunately my camera isn't good enough to watch things in the dark. But thank you everybody so much for watching, I love you all, stay groovy, bye bye.